No, I have opened in the laptop. Good evening. Give me a second, guys. I'll be right back. Okay. But See, I so guess that, that you can take a picture with your cam, with the cam of your cell phone. Mm -hmm. And send it where? To the... Yes, and, and share. When you touch your your screen, you and your cell phone, you can watch the bottom compartir. And you can compart you can share the the picture that you that yeah, you but the problem is that I have the homework is in the laptop. And yes, I, take a picture of your laptop. Ah, with, with the cell phone. Sorry, I'm going to do something. Okay. Yes, that's right. This is this is the screen that you're going to take. It says take review, but only can see two two at the same time. Okay, let's okay, see if, if I one I it. can make the screenshot. I I made it, uh -huh. and I can share. Ah, okay. And I, I guess that, oh, okay, I'm sure that, okay, is here to you? See, sí. but, yes. Yes. but I go into because, because the, I'm, I'm the, the color of my screen, just give me one second. Uh, if you want, uh, I'm going to uh, stop the protest. Hey guys, eight o'clock already. Thank you very much for being here. And now, oh, so much sharing. And we are so Maria, happy. Maria is searching is searching Can you hear me guys? something. Yes, yes, but Maria yeah, is searching something that, for, that she wanted to ask you, teacher. I want to ask you this. I was last night. I was doing the the homework. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? And I found that the first six uh, part are, are the same that we were doing in your class last night but look what i have i i i choose and i was uh, and i did exactly class but it says that is wrong you see the the which one which exercise <clears throat> sorry which exercise is that is the the first one in the in the homework two point or two point whatever it's not the two point two it's and are the same topics that we were talking about yesterday. Mm -hmm. So in the in the first one, where it says the meaning of reliable seller is right. A seller you can trust anything, anything. When it says fake review, I chose the one that we did. And, and it says it's wrong. Positive if it's, or negative feedback. If it's 2.5, Maria, can you hear me? If it's yes. two point five, I think that there are uh, some some errors on the platform, right? So what we're gonna do is after the class, if you want, I mean, not in the recording, right? Mm -hmm. But right after the class, as I'm doing, I'm trying to do every single night. I'm gonna stay for about 15, 20 minutes, and we can actually look into those details. I'm gonna help you out. No worries about it. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Yes, because I think is is getting wrong, and I am about the midterm it was mm -hmm. the same wrong uh, two, uh, options and then we will not have a good mm -hmm. and Correct. it's not because you have not told us how to do it is because the platform has something correct and i'm gonna check that because i was working with someone uh yesterday who who asked me for help and i think that to some of them you don't have to add the period uh some of them have like do have a double period uh -huh. But, so, yeah, but in this exercise, you, you don't you don't have to write any check. Just choose the one you the option you want. We're gonna go through that uh, after uh, the class. Here is no not is not a uh, room for you don't need to write anything. Just click. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Like I don't know what is what is going on. Like there. as I mentioned, at 10 p.m. when we finish the class, 
I'm going to start actually helping you guys with the exercises. And tomorrow, we are going to have a review, Maria Isabel. So tomorrow, we're going to review all of the topics so I can get you ready for the midterm. Mm -hmm. If you check, well, I think it's tomorrow. Let me just confirm. Give me a second. Oh, no, no. In uh, next Friday, from this Friday to the next, we are going to review every single topic so I can get you ready for the midterm. And today, I'm going to help you review all of the, the exercises that you might have questions. Right after the class, we can communicate each other via WhatsApp. You got my commitment on that one. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much. You're welcome. So guys, um, thank you very much for being here. Um, this is Alejandro Narbona on behalf of Inglés Corporativo. Today, we have a little bit more of a reported speech, right? But before we go that, do you remember yesterday's topic? What were we talking about yesterday? What was the topic that, that we were covering yesterday? Like interview and inconvenience with shopping online and experiences in sharing. Mm -hmm. Inconveniences of uh, shopping online. Now, as far as those, um, well, as far as that topic, do you guys have any questions? Something that you might have any doubt that you might have? From the class, no, but when I see the homework, I have a, <laughs> a many, many. Yeah. yeah, don't worry about it. I got you on that one. I just gotta follow the, uh, I just gotta follow what the platform is asking us to do. And out of the platform, yes, we can extend as many as you want. I'll take care of that today with you, promise. Pinky promise, right? Okay, guys. So um, thank you very much for being here. We are going to be covering reported speech. Before that, who can tell me, we already covered this, when do we use reported speech? Just one person, just one volunteer. There's no right or wrong. Me, Eric. <laughs> Go ahead, Eric. Thank you. Okay, we use reporter speech when we want to replay that someone else has said something. Mm -hmm. When someone else has, what someone else has said. Now, we have covered yes, no questions. We have covered imperatives, right? And today we are going to cover informational questions. Do you guys know what an informational question is? Or information question? No, exactly. Not exactly? Okay. If no. I ask you, are you okay? What is your answer? I'm good, yes, I'm fine. Am. Uh -huh. fine so, thank you. Well, but that will be, how are you? If I ask you, are you happy? The answer is? Uh, yes. Yes, yes or I no. am or yes. no. So those are yes, no questions, right? The yes, no question yes. is when what you expect from the other person is a simple yes or a simple no. With information mm -hmm. questions, you expect something else. For example, we can use every single grammar tense. If I tell you, how are you? Then your answer is going to be, I am fine. I am happy. I am sad. Is the message that you want to that you want to say. If I tell you, how old are you? Ooh, uh, don't, don't answer. I never finish. Yeah, don't answer. <laughs> I don't want to get in trouble with anybody here. So, where do you live? Right? For example, Beatriz Adriana, where do you live? I live in San Juan Pico. Good. Is that an information question or a yes, no question? Information. Information, yes. information question. Correct. Morena, are you, are you sad? No. Okay, yes, no, or information no, question? Not sad. Uh, yes, no. Uh huh, that's a yes, no question. So, do you have any doubt about the difference between yes, no questions and information questions? 
No. 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 Good. What are the no words? No, until I see the next homework. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're, you're kind of worried about the homework. I know, I know. I'm worried too. I am definitely worried too. Okay. Uh, um, what are the words that we use to get more information? I already gave you one. How? What else? When. Maybe when. When. Uh huh. Where. 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 What. Which. Which. Uh huh. What. what? Who. 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 Where. Uh huh. Where. Another one? Where, when you want when, to know the reason of something? Where, why? When, why? Uh huh. Whom? Or is double H? Mm -hmm. So all of these are known as WH words, right? These are the words that we use to ask information questions. Okay? Very good. So, guys, um, today I'm going to be using the book. Right? And then I'm going to be showing you something on the internet. I'm not going to send you any link, you know that. But all I did was reported speech information questions, enter. The next search, reported speech information questions, exercises. So you have everything in the palm of your hand with the internet. All right? Now, let's get it ready. Please go ahead and read with me, please. How to use reported speech information questions. How to use reported speech, to use reported reported speech, speech information, 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 information questions. questions. Look at the examples in the box. Then complete the exercises below. Look at the examples in the box. Then complete the exercise below. Exercises. 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 Very good. I need a volunteer to read that, please. Me teacher, me teacher. Me yeah. teacher and the name, because when uh, I'm me, sharing, me Daniel, sorry, see. sorry. There you sorry, go, my boy. Okay. <laughs> How to use reported speech information questions. Mm -hmm. Look at the examples in the box. They complete the exercise below. Ah, yeah. There is a, a typo. This guy is known as a typo. When the typing is done incorrectly, it's a typo. So, how do you say error en el typeo? Type. Typo. Typo. Mm -hmm. Typo. When you use that O at the end, wow. you are making emphasis that is something bad. What do you think? What is, and again, I don't want to be disrespectful. I just, this is just a word. Dumb. What is dumb? Tonto. Uh -huh. Tonto. Yeah, no me digan así, pero good. That, that's exactly what it is. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. So, Don, um, what is the name of the elephant that can fly with its ears? Dumbo. Dumbo. Which in English is going to be dumb Dumbo. Dumbo. Uh, so Dumbo. It's like they are making emphasis that the elephant is a little, you know, lack, lack of intelligence. I guess we all, we all have seen Dumbo, right? So, that's yeah. why. If you see something with an O like that, is they are making emphasis that is something negative or something uh, bad. All right, so let's go ahead and continue here. Remember, repeat after me, please. Remember. 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 When reporting things that other people say or ask. When reporting things that other people say or ask. The verb tense often shifts back. The verb tense often shifts back. Shifts back. Shifts back. Correct. Shift. I need a volunteer to read that, please. Me, Morena. Okay. Thank you, Moreco. Remember, when reporting things, things that other people say or ask, the verb tense often shifts back. Uh -huh. Nice. I liked it. But let's focus a little bit on the ending sounds of shifts. Shifts, shifts, shifts back. Shifts back. Shifts, shifts back. Shifts back. Shifts back. Shift back. It's a little bit difficult because we don't normally have that phoneme in Spanish. Right? So shifts. Shifts, shifts back. Shifts shift back. Back. Uh-huh. You see? Back. 
Estoy escuchando varios que solo quedan en la T, porque no es normal en español. Shift. 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 So, shift. 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 Okay. Shift. Now I'm hearing a, a little bit more S's. Good. So, what is the meaning of shift, shifts back, guys? Al final. Uh -huh. Go back one tenth. To go back one tenth, exactly. That's with all reported speech. So, if we have past, if we have simple present, we use simple, simple past. past. Simple past. That's right. If we have uh, present continuous, we use. Past continuous. Past continuous. If we have present perfect, we use. Past, past perfect. 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 Uh -huh. If we have will, we use. Would. 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 If we have, uh, what is the other one that we were using? Can. Can. The past is. Yeah. Could. 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 And so on and so on. Now let me ask you something. Does past perfect have past? No. 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 Ahí ¿vea? Okay, great. So, here, we're going to go with the structure. We're going to try to make it quick. Read it with me, please. Report information questions. Report information questions. Information questions. questions. Now, pause here. Pay attention to my intonation. Report information questions. I go up Report. in pitch because I haven't finished. Okay? I go up in pitch because I haven't finished my message. So that lets the person know that something else is coming. So report information questions using ask, I go down, inquire, I go down Very in intonation, yes, want to know, etc. So, les voy a explicar esto en, en español súper rapidito. Prácticamente cuando nosotros hablamos hay una melodía. ¿Ok? Tanto en español, en Guatemala, si pues, ¿eh? ahí cantadito, right? o San Miguel, o San Salvador, whatever. Cuando nosotros dejamos el, la entonación para arriba, como en las yes, no questions, are you okay? Cuando le dejamos para arriba es que viene más información. Report information questions using ask. Y cada vez que nosotros tenemos una coma, vamos a bajar la entonación. ¿Ok? Cada vez que hay coma o punto, bajamos la entonación para que la persona sepa que ese, esa parte del mensaje ya terminó. So, pay attention to the intonation here. Report information questions using ask, inquire, want to know, plus WH word, plus clause. Right? You have to train your ear. It might not be easy at the beginning. Report information questions. I go up using ask, that's down, ask, inquire, want to know, plus WH word, plus clause. Caigo con entonación. <clears throat> okay, so I'm gonna say one more time, then I want you to repeat as a group, and then I need one brave person to try and do it. Three, two, one. Report information questions using ask, inquire, want to know, plus WH word, plus clause. Go, please. For information, for information questions, 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 ask, questions, 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 Plus WH word plus plus. Nice. I like your intonation. So how are you going to get this intonation? Repeating from videos, from music, not that much because that is art. Well, it is actually, it is art. So they actually try to make it sound good, not grammatically uh -huh. correct. So be careful, especially with hip hop. They make a lot of mistakes. So let's go with simple present. Present. What is the process to return a product? What is the process, what is the process, what is the process to return a product? Mm -hmm. That is a direct question. So 
Then we have with the structure, the same as before. Who is asking? That customer. The customer. Then we have the phrase. Hmm? Which, which can be actually, um, which can be ask, which can be inquire, want to know, the one that you want makes no change. The WH word here, which in this case is what, the same as in the question before. And then what the process to return a product was. Okay, so let me ask you something. What happens to the verb to be? It's in past at the end. <laughs> it is in past and it's at the end. Correct. So what, what? The process, the process. To return a product, to return a product. What is the difference between and I'm gonna do it this here. If we focus on all of this, what is the difference between this and this question? The order of the words. Mm -hmm. sure. The order of the words. What is the word that changes? The verb. The verb, the verb to be. We send it to the back. And it's in past. And it is in past. Exactly. So that's the only change, guys. That is the exact only change. Going to the end. Mm -hmm. It's going to the end. So let's focus on the chat here. If I tell you what is your name, this is a direct question, right? Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead and change it to reported speech. Teacher asked, the teacher asked, asked our name what, what, what her name was. What oh. my name was. Aha, uh -huh. oh. exactly. Very good. What my name was. Okay. Hey, what is your name? Mira, dice que cuál es mi nombre. Right? Le estamos diciendo a alguien que me preguntó a mí por mi nombre. So that's why we change it to my. Exactly. The teacher asked what my name was. was. Do we use a question mark? No. No. No, we don't. No. Next one. Remember that this is with simple present right now, but we can do it with almost all of them. What um what is your <laughs> intention with my daughter? No. Some of you might have asked that question already. What is your intention eh? with my daughter? Oh my. How do you say, la suegra preguntó? Ah, oh, mi suegra preguntó. My mother-in-law mother asked me. Asked? Me. Asked. Ah, good, good, good. Ask. Quítenle el mi. What is, me. what the, what? What was mine? What, what? Intentions with her daughter. What? 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 My intentions. My intention with, 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 with my daughter. Her daughter was. With her daughter was. Was. I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, my nobody My daughter asked. Well, that question. <laughs> okay, give me another WH question in simple present with the verb to be. Because there is a change, verb to be and the other verbs. Why can't, why? With is, uh, uh, why? Is. Uh-huh. Hello. Why is, uh-huh. Hello. The labor <laughs> that, the law? that can stop, stop kill my 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 song in law. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and say why is the law corrupt? <laughs> Sorry. 
why is the law corrupt? Why How do you say, corrupt? la gente preguntó? People, people asked. Ask. The people asked. Ask. Why? Ask. Why? Why the law corrupt? The law, law. law corrupt. Corrupt what? <laughs> why? Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. Corrupt was or was corrupt? Corrupt was. Was corrupt. Was corrupt. Was corrupt. Why? Why? Because of the context. Because if we say it as the as the rule is, it's not gonna make sense. So right, it has to make sense. Now, any question with this structure, guys? Because we have a lot of exercises today. I don't understand. I didn't understand the last uh, oh. question. The last question. Okay. Now, if you notice, we have always the people. Who is saying that? The people. What is the verb? Asked. The WH word following the, the structure. Why? And then we have the clause in the sentence word order. That means that it has to make sense. This is the incorrect way to do it. The people asked why the law corrupt was. This is incorrect. So it is correct if we supposedly follow the structure, but it is not correct in the sentence word order because in Spanish, it wouldn't make sense either. La gente preguntó por qué la ley corrupta fue. Entonces, tenemos que darle vuelta. We have to shift it in this particular case so it can make sense. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, um, when, when is your birthday? If the teacher asked, uh, teacher? when my birthday was uh-huh who is saying it the teacher right yes then we have the word asked then we have the wh when word when my birthday was my birthday was good now guys with your hand in your heart, is this giving you problems? Be honest, because otherwise, I mean, the purpose is for you to learn. No. No until this point. We'll see later. <laughs> you know, I, I like the way you think. All right, so remember, start copying everything that I write down in the chat. Open a, a, a Word document, but copy it. So now let's go ahead and go. This is only with the verb to be. Okay. Let's go ahead and read the following. Read it with me, please. When do you expect the package to arrive? When do you expect the package to arrive? To arrive. Correct. So let's get the order. Who is saying it? Customer. What is the, the, the word, the verb? Asked. 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 Right? WH word? When. 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 Mm -hmm. oh, when. Perdón, me estaba haciendo la de arriba. So, a customer asked when, when. we expected when. the package to arrive. What is the difference? What do you think that it has changed? The verb in past. Uh -huh, the verb in past, as we always do. Is there something missing? We? The verb. Auxiliary do. The auxiliary do. What happens to the auxiliary do? Yeah. You eliminate it. Disappears. It disappears. Yeah. Okay, okay, mm -hmm. okay. So when, obviously, you have to look for the context, right? It, here, it can be I or it can be we. 
because we don't know if the question is for many people, like in this case with we, or if it's for one person. Then the verb goes in the past and we keep the next, we keep the same. I see a lot of poker faces right now. So let's go ahead and practice my friends. Um, where does your brother live? That's the question. Help me please. Let's say that Andrea is Hello. asking. Andrea asked. Andrea asked. Where my brother lived. My, where my brother lived. Lived. Mm -hmm. And we use the main verb in the past tense. Okay, let's get another one. Um, why do you like to drink? Mi mamá. <laughs> Uh -huh. My mother asked. My mother asked why. Why. why like. In the subject. I like. Why, why I. I. Why I. Uh huh. Like. Like. To drink. Why I like it to drink. Why I like, like to drink. Drunk. 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 No, in this case, drunk. it's going to be drink because drink. Uh -huh, the verb, the main verb is like. Drink is just oh, a okay. compliment. Let me give you one more and then I'm, gonna, I'm having issues with my internet connection. Oh, sorry to hear that, Andrea. So, when does Ricardo have internet issues help me with this one and um andrea is asking mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when does ricardo have internet issues andrea, andrea asked when, uh, when 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 ricardo ricardo Mm -hmm. had, 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 had internet, internet issues. issues. Correct. So, let's go ahead and analyze it. Voy a usar un poquito de español una vez más para evitar confusiones. So, prácticamente tenemos la pregunta WH, en este caso es simple present. Siempre ponemos quién nos está preguntando, Andrea, el verbo que nosotros queramos en pasado, ya sea asked, inquired, wanted to know. Inquired. Y luego prácticamente lo que vamos a hacer es poner la misma pregunta, pero le damos en la neck al, al verbo auxiliar, en este caso es el do. Lo quitamos. Eso prácticamente es todo. Luego viene jugar un poquito, guys, con el sujeto. Por ejemplo, si, si ponen you, tendríamos que poner I. I. ¿Vean? Porque me están preguntando a mí. Mira, ella está preguntando que por qué yo. Pero si ustedes se fijan, como es una tercera persona, Ricardo, ocupamos siempre a Ricardo. Si fuera Ana María, ocuparíamos siempre a Ana María. Entonces, solo hay que jugar un poquito con el hecho de quién estamos hablando. All right. Any question? That's my favorite question. When I ask any questions, nobody asks anything. Okay, guys. So, <laughs> this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you a couple of examples, and I want you to create them. You're going to work in teams, and you're going to try to do it yourselves. Okay? So, when, when is your wedding? Why is your dog happy? Pay attention to the last part. You need to make it make sense. Um, what is your favorite food? 
Now, give me a second. There's people in the pool. Give me a second. Okay, so let's go ahead and continue. Um, what do you like for dinner? When do you buy clothes? Where does your family live? All right, guys, go ahead and copy this question. I'm gonna send them to WhatsApp. Three of those are with the verb to be, and the other three are with simple present, the normal simple present. All right, go ahead and accept the invite. You got six examples I'm gonna give you. Five minutes, all right? Any questions? No. No. Let's rock it, guys. No. There you go. Go ahead and accept the invite, please. Yes, and Abner, where is Abner? Abner. Maybe he didn't listen. Okay, now let's start then. The yes. first one is, when is, when when is, is your, your wedding? wedding. Yeah, and okay. now we have to, to select to who is asking, right? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna put Abner, ask me, ask. Ah, exactly, ask, correct. Ask, um, when my wedding, my wedding was, was, okay. Next one, why is your dog happy? Okay, I'm gonna put Morena. Morena, ask, ask, ask me why, why my dog, why my dog, my dog was happy. No, happy was not. <laughs> why what? my dog was That's happy? Was. Yes, why my dog was happy. Because otherwise yes. it doesn't make sense. All right, you're doing yeah. good. Let me check okay. another group. What is your favorite food? Um, okay, I'm gonna put Andrea. Maybe uh, ask what my favorite my favorite food was. What? Pronunciation, yes. favorite. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah, we, we do not pronounce the O. Well. Favorite. Favorite. Mm -hmm. Favorite. Favorite, okay. So. Let me call her favorite. Okay, favorite. You got three minutes. Okay. What do you like for dinner? Okay. Uh, ask. Roxana asked. Why? Uh, what? What? Why? What? 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 Okay. what? For what I like. I like. What? For like. dinner. For dinner. I Doing like good. For dinner. When my wedding was. Yes. When my wedding was or when was my wedding? 
when my wedding was. Uh -huh. <laughs> exactly. No doubt. I like that. <laughs> no, no, no. You're trying to confuse me. No. <laughs> no, I was just testing you. Uh, no, 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 no. All right. See you in two minutes. Hey guys, how are you doing? Where does your family live? Hello. Yeah, asked. So Adriana asked. Adriana asked where. Where, Adriana? where my family. My family. Fe family. 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 Family lived. Not really with a. My we don't family. say family, and we don't pronounce the i either. We say like family. 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 We go from the M to the L I. Lived. Family. Lived. Okay. Family. Mm -hmm. Family. Family. Just so we finish. We finish. Hello. Okay. Hello. I, we see you. Aldo. Hello. Um, my internet connection is very, very poor. Yeah. Unstable. Un unstable. Unstable. If, yeah, okay. very unstable. All right, great. Uh, so now that you're finished, the time finished also. Great job. Let's go back. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, so we are coming back. People is coming back little by little. Alrighty, guys, I need a volunteer for the first one. Mm -hmm. Me, Sarah. Okay, go ahead, Sarah, please. As when my wedding was. Say it again, please. Roxana asked when my wedding was. Is that correct, guys? Yes. Yeah, okay, yes. great. Yes. Whenever we come back from the break rooms, normally the system mutes your microphones automatically. Ah, uh, yes, 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 sorry. <laughs> okay, so okay. I know that there's a lot of people trying to participate, but you're muted. Great, it is correct. Okay. Volunteer for number two, why is your dog happy? Me, Me Karen. Karen. Nice, I like it. So, Ana Maria one and Karen the next one. Thank you. Ana Maria? Um, what is your favorite food? The, the... The new form, he asked why, let me see, yes, no, 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 he asked why my dog was happy, I think, because okay. the question was, why is your dog happy? Uh-huh, he asked I, why my dog? He asked why my dog was happy. Is that correct, guys? Yes. I don't know. Yes, yes it is, exactly. Yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. We don't normally comply with the rule mm -hmm. that the verb to be goes at the end, but the thing is that if we do it at the end, it makes no sense, right? So great. Um, Karen, help me out with, what is your favorite food? Please. Karen? Number three. Yes, please. What is your favorite food? Uh, they asked what my favorite food was. Is that correct? Yes. yes. Excellent. It yes, is. That is correct. Mm -hmm. So just remember, guys, the pronunciation is favorite. We favorite. don't pronounce the favorite. 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 Nice. favorite. favorite. Volunteer for favorite. what do you like for dinner? Come on, just one, don't be afraid. <laughs> me, Daniel, me, Daniel. There you go, Daniel, go ahead. Okay, why do you like for dinner? Okay, mm -hmm. uh, she asked why my why I like for dinner. Okay. She asked why I liked for dinner. Yes, but let's go ahead and change why, because we are using what. What? Okay, so what it's what, I what, what. Like. Don't be sorry, Daniel, thank you very much. Next okay, one, no when do you buy clothes? Volunteer, please. Me, Morena. Go ahead, Morena. Andrea asked when I bought my clothes. Correct. 
Excellent. Uh, when I bought my clothes or when I bought clothes? Like the same context, uh, yes. And the last one, where does your family live? Me, Marcel. Go ahead, Marcel. Uh, he asked where my family lived. Lived, excellent. Okay, lived. Remember that family is not actually like we are used to do it. We don't say family, family right? It is not with a. Family. We say like family. 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 No va con a. No decimos, no abrimos la boca acá. A. Family. No que decimos como que f. Family. F. Family. 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 Mm -hmm. Do not open your mouth completely. Just for you to know, keep on practicing. Any doubts about this, my mm -hmm. friends? Any, Any questions? No. Is it easy or is it not? Not that easy, but with practice. Uh huh. Okay. So remember, when we go from simple present, we shift back to Simple past. Simple. Now, simple. if we have okay. simple past, right? We go to past, past perfect. perfect. So, perfect. when did you ship my order? Repeat after me, please. When did you ship my order? When did you ship, did you ship, ship my, order? my order? Who is asking? Customer. Customer. A customer. Asked. 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 When, the WH, when, 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 when we have sent his order. Mm -hmm. his order. Right. There are a couple of assumptions here, guys. Number one, I would have used shipped instead of sent. I don't know why they changed the verb. Okay. So please don't get confused with this. I would have okay. used shipped. And uh, then we have the past perfect, which is subject, auxiliary had, all the time, verb in the past possible. And then why his order? Because they are assuming that the customer is a man, right? But you could perfectly do her order. Because when we say a customer, how many customers are we talking about? One. 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 Exactly. How many options do we have? And I'm sorry, but gender ideology does not fit here. We have he or she grammatically. Right? Okay. So it can be his order or her order. Right? Okay. okay. Which items, remember that we can have complements with WH words. Which items did you pick from the catalog? Who is saying that? Sales agent. Sales, sales, sales agent. agent. Asked. Uh, which, which items? Items. Which items? items. Which items all of this I, is the, the WH, right? Yeah. Items is just a compliment. You, I, had I picked from the catalog. Had picked. From the catalog. From the catalog. 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 Mm -hmm. Correct. Catalog. catalog. That's right. So, guys, let's <laughs> do a customer. Why did you um, sleep last night? Why did you sleep last night? Who is asking? Uh, you. <laughs> okay. Alejandro. 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 Uh huh. Oh, ask. 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 The WH. Why? 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 I Why? Had slept. Had slept. Had slept. Slept. Last Very night. Good. Last, Last night. night. Last night. Great. Excellent. One more. Um. When did you travel to New York? When did you travel to New York? Let's do it in reported speech. His 
He asked. He asked. When. When. I had. I had. I had. I had. I had. Traveled to New York. New York. Excellent. Hey. All right. Great. So let's go ahead and go with give me please six questions in simple past with WH words. Just the questions. Don't change them. Wow. What do you eat for dinner? What did you eat for dinner? I like it. Give me some more, please. Five more. Mm -hmm. Don't change it. Don't change it. Just give me the, the WH questions with simple past. Why did you travel alone? Why did you travel alone? Excellent. Four more. Which movies did did? Uh -huh. Which movies did? Which Let's did you watch? Change the subject. Which movies did you watch? Change the subject. Which, which, uh, which, no, sorry, did, which, did, 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 huh? Give me any name, guys. My brother, my father, your brothers. Okay. So, who did call yesterday? Okay, did your, your family, I'm gonna, so we can practice the pronunciation. Your family. Watch yesterday. Right? One, two, three. Give me three more, please. With when? How was? How was okay, how what? Mm. How was your day? No. Oh, you saw W. We are with a... Yes, but yeah. let's keep it right now because of the structure with simple past, but with other verbs. Not with to be, so we don't break the, the, the pattern. Para que no quebremos el patrón. But that was a good question, though. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Why do you have problem with your with your? Come on, say it. Say it. With your. <laughs> say what is it. your problem with your your? I don't know who say oh. con la red para conectarse. <laughs> Ah, why did you have problems oh, Aldo. Aldo. with the network? Could be network. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. Fine, so let's change it. Why did Aldo have problems with the network? Give me two more, please. With when? Uh, maybe when, when did you paint the house? Your family? Uh -huh. When did change the subject? You Forget about you. When did Adriana paint the house? Right. And one more, the last one. One, two, three, four, five. Who was, who was your sister? Mm, yes, oh. but let's not use was right now, so we don't break okay. the pattern. But that's a good question, too. Mm, when? Now we already. What time? What time? What time did you, did you come? You got up. Let's forget about you. Let's get out of your comfort zones, guys. Did Marito, Pedrito, Juanito, Fulanito, Chicharito. What time did your sister came? Did your sister come? Come, come. correct. Yeah, come. Come, excellent. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and work with these questions. You got five minutes. Remember, the, pa the, the past, perfect. Okay? Go ahead and accept the invite. Perfect. Five minutes, we come back. Oops, I was about to share Ooh. something. Breakout rooms. You're going to share the questions? Yes, I'm going to do okay. it right now. Thank to the you. WhatsApp group. Yeah, thank you. Why did you? All right, so the questions have been sent, guys.
Inez. You can ask the next question, Eric, to to to. Celia. Well, yes, to Celia. Gladys, are you still having? Oops, I have the camera off. Are you still having issues with your internet connection? Yeah, sometimes it's because um, I also have problems with light. Sometimes it goes. Yeah, no, no, no. Don't worry. So I just want Insafor to know that that you are here. And sometimes you have issues with the internet. I understand. Mm -hmm. Whenever it's possible, keep it on. If you have to turn it off because of the bandwidth and your connection, then yes, turn it off. Okay, okay. All right. What do you? Which one do you have, guys? Yeah. It's working on the second one. What is the second one? Why is the second one? Celia, well, why did you travel alone? So the uh, report speech would be. Um, uh, Celia Eric. ask or Eric ask mm -hmm. why why I had, had trouble alone. alone. Mm -hmm. <coughs> nice, you're getting the hang of it. Next, uh, Gladys, are you still here? Yes, uh, oh, okay. I'm waiting for it. Oh, <laughs> you're in the chat. Okay. Good, good. The next question. Can you ask me the next the next question if you want to? Celia, could you ask Gladys? Yeah, give me one second. Okay. The next one is which movies did your family watch yesterday? Okay. So Celia ask. Celia ask. Celia ask. Which movies? Which movies? My family had had watch, watch. watched. Uh -huh. Good pronunciation. Watched. 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 My family watched, watched. Uh -huh. yesterday. Yesterday. Good. All right. Let me check one more group, and then we'll go back to the break room, to the main room. Okay. Um, Eric. Uh, Adriana. Adriana had. Had painted. Painted her house. Painted the house. The house. Mm -hmm. the house or her house? Um, her house. Whatever. Uh, take take a look I at think, the context. I think both both uh both, both form options. I, yeah, both okay. option as right. Okay. Good. Good. Okay, In two okay. minutes we go back. Okay. 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 The, the, and last, the last, last one. one. Last one. He asked, he asked what time what time my sister my sister how uh -huh, how okay, my come had come had, mm -hmm. nice way of remembering the verbs had came yeah <laughs> had mm. come come, had come. come. Come, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Came, come, yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'll do hard, hard okay. We finished. Okay. Finish. Great. So we're gonna yeah. go back to the main room right now. Thank you, guys. Good okay. job. Okay. Okay, teacher. Alrighty, so we're gonna give it a few seconds for the rest of the people to come back to the main room and we're gonna take attendance. <coughs> okay, people is coming back. Nice, 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 nice. Alrighty guys, so um, let's go ahead and, and um, Take attendance so we can continue with the rest of the class. Is this being difficult so far? Because I see that you have been able to manage it. Maybe you don't have we a, have uh, a little a bit of issues at all. Yeah. No, we don't have difficulties. Uh, all right, good. So the issues come later. later. I, I know you will have a lot of questions. Don't worry about that. Yeah. 
Okay, so um, let's take attendance. Ana Maria Marroquín Rivera. Me, present. I see you. Andrea del Carmen Martínez Aragón. Present. I see you too. Javier Rodrigo Ayala Córdoba. No, okay. Daniel Edgardo Canizales Ventura. I, I didn't hear you, but I saw you. <laughs> Gladys Dalia Meléndez Hernández. Present. Ah, there you are. Aldo Sadi Castro Pleites. Present. Thank you, sir. I know you're having internet connection issues, so thank you. Eric Arnaldo Celaya Ayala. Present. Thank you. Ernesto Antonio Castillo. Castillo. Present. Oh, I see you. Amy Melissa Rosa Palacios. Not here. David Orlando Nerio. Present. See you. Marcela Beatriz Lopez Pira. Didn't hear you, but I saw you. Present. Okay. <laughs> Roxana Domitilio Ríos de Quiñones. Present. See you too. Juan Carlos Garcia Laines. Oh, um, por motivos de INSAFORP, eh, de auditoría, Juan Carlos tuvo un pequeño percance automovilístico, se encuentra bien de salud, pero no se pudo presentar por ese motivo. Va a estar presente el día de mañana. Beatriz Adriana Martínez Merino. Present. I see you. Abner Alexis Martínez Rivas. Present. See you too, man. Morena Guadalupe Melara Cruz. I see you too. Alison Isabel Ayala Alfaro. Mm, not here. Celia Carmina Pineda Avalos. Present. I see you too. Karen Eileen Garcia Benitez. Present. There you are. Sara Elizabeth Ruiz Ortiz. Present. Okay, I see you. And last but not least, Maria Isabel Herrera de Garcia. Present. Okay, very good. So, guys, let's get the... No, 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 breakout rooms, no. Almost, almost, almost. Let's go ahead and check the chat. And uh, I need some of you to help me out. Mm -hmm. First one, what did you eat for dinner? Volunteer. Me, Karen. Go ahead, Karen. He asked mm -hmm. what I had eaten for dinner. Is that correct? Yes. It is. Great job. Yes. Next one. Why did you travel alone? Me, Ana Maria. Go ahead. She asked why I had traveled alone. Is that correct? Yes. Yes. It is indeed. Thank you. Which movies did your family watch yesterday? Hey, Daniel. Go ahead, sir. They asked which movies my family had watched yesterday. Nice. Good job with the pronunciation of watched. Too many, for okay. many people, that one is different. It's difficult. Um, why did Aldo have problems with the network? Aldo asked why he had had problems with the network. Excellent. Had had. Great. Uh -huh. When did Adriana paint the house? Come on, Buenos Aires. Yeah, um, go ahead. She asked when Adriana had painted the house. Is that correct? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes. It, is. it is. What time did your sister come? Volunteer. Me, Eric. Celia asked what time my sister had come. Is that correct? Yes. What? Yes. Time. Okay. Very good. So, as you can see, we have been working so nice. much with reported speech that we are getting the hang of it. Do you know what is the meaning of to get the hang of it? No. To get no. the hang of it is to get used to. Can you read it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you read it? Yes, ma'am. To get the hang of it. Uh, wait, uh, give me a second. I send it to Antonio. 
to Ernesto Antonio privately. Let me send it to the whole group. There it is, to get the hang of it. To get the hang of it. Okay, good, thank you very much. And uh, Ernesto, um, again, por motivo de auditoría, gracias por decir, dejarme saber el, el, la situación con las luces en el aeropuerto. Okay, so thank you very much. Communication is very important, guys, and I totally appreciate yours. You are a very committed group. Thank you. Now, let's go to the last one that we're going to cover. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. What did you What did you say that meaning to get the hang of it? Agarrarle el hilo, acostumbrarse, entenderlo un poquito más. So you can ask. Thank you. You can actually conjugate it like, I am getting the hang of it. In buen salvadoreño, le estoy agarrando la onda. You can ask, did you, hang, did you get the hang of it? ¿La agarraste la onda? Yes, I, ha I have. How, how, do you, how, do you, how do you do the answer? Yes, I get it. Yes, I hang of it. it is, is that a yes, no question or an informational question? Did you get the hang of it? Yes or no. So yes, yes or no. Question. So we're going to answer? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Or? Yes. No, I didn't. No, I, no, I didn't. didn't. Very yes. good. Okay. So let's go with the last one here. Sorry. Did someone say something? Yes, me. Teacher, uh, when the, did you send the PDF book of English? If I have sent, <clears throat> I'm sorry. If I have sent the PDF book, no, I haven't. But you have it in your platform. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. There, there is a part. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look for it. Okay. Um, where you, you can have access to the to the material. So let's go with the last one, guys. Will. What is the past of will? Will. 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 Correct. So read with me, please. When will my package arrive? When, when will my package, package arrive? arrive. 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 Who is asking? Customer. Uh, customer. customer. The customer. What is the phrase that we're going to ask, that we're going to use? Ask. Ask. WH, when? When? The package would arrive. Would arrive. What is the difference that you can see there? Change. Analyze it a little bit. What, what's the change? Uh, the actually verb is before before the the verb, and the verb is to the end of the sentence. Uh huh. So pretty much we have what is the we have the the noun right? Who are we talking about? The package, right? Package. So we have package. the subject. Then we have would instead of will. And then at the end, we have the verb plus the complement. Mm -hmm. okay. So let's go with the next one. What will be the subtitle for my purchase? What will be the subtitle for my purchase? Who is asking? A customer. A customer. A customer. What is the phrase that we are using? Asked. And then we have the WH, right? W, WH. WH question. Mm -hmm. Then we have the subject. What is the subject? The, sub the, sub the subtotal, the, correct. The subtotal. Mm -hmm. Then we have would. Would instead of will. Would. Uh -huh. would. Then we have the verb. Be. And then the complement. Now. For this okay. purchase. We use the course. verb. In simple present. Exactly. That was my next question. Good, um, good point, Roxana. Why? I don't know. Maybe it's because we <laughs> already use the future like would. Exactly. Because we already changed will for would. That is exactly why the verb is going to stay in the same form. Good analysis. I see that you're getting the hang of it already, guys. Okay. So, <laughs> good. Hey, guys, listen. 
Dense un poco de crédito y se los digo bien yeah. en serio. Yeah, Dense yeah, crédito, yeah. ustedes saben más de lo que piensan que saben. Lo peor que pueden decir es no puedo. All right? wow. Obviamente viendo, no sé, física cuántica o algo así, si no es su área, la van a tener difícil. Right? But little by little with practice you're gonna get the hang of it. All right. So let's get a few, a few examples with this. Let me see what will um, Maritza, I don't know who Maritza is, but I'm going to use her name. Maritza, do. Give me a second. I was sending it again to Ernesto. What will Maritza do tomorrow? Help me with this one, guys. Who is asking? Teacher. <laughs> the teacher. Oh, the teacher. teacher. Uh -huh. Asked. Asked. What? 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 do What? 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 Now, when will, when will you give me my money back? <laughs> Talking about companies, right? Not, not people. When will you give me my money back? Um, Who's asking for the money to a company? Alejandro. Okay, you are a client, you know. Okay. <laughs> yes, Alejandro <laughs> or the customer, it doesn't matter. Alejandro. <laughs> Asked, asked when when you was the company no mm. when when the company exactly when the company company or we would depends you can remember that here you have points of view and if I am asking a company you can say we if you are an employee, or you can say the company, right? It's points of view. Alejandro asked when the company would give, would, me, would would give, him, give, him, give him his money um, back. Acuérdense que en el primero le quitábamos el me. Yeah? Yeah. When would give, give his money, my back. money back. His, his money back. Mm -hmm. Money back. Now, ¿por qué no le ponemos would give him his money back? Porque suena... It, it is redundant. Porque ya tenemos Alejandro. Right? So, it is not needed to avoid repetition. Is this clear? This was a tricky one. I love those questions. Is this clear? And <laughs> clear silence. All right, guys, give me, clear give like me, <laughs> clear as in as what the water. All right, give me please examples with normal WH will questions. Why will you so far? Why will you move so far? You're missing someone, I see. So far. Yes. I will be... Why will you move so far? Mm -hmm. Another one with when. Guys, I'm going to give you another tip. I know that it's difficult to come up with complete sentences, right? So work with the structure. When will. Give me a subject, any subject. Bar Barney, Donald Trump, uh, whoever, no importa, it doesn't matter. When will? Will Smith. Who? When will Smith. Will Smith, so it's a little bit confusing. When will Will Smith, <laughs> verb, any verb. Visit El Salvador. Visit El Salvador. Okay, good. Give me another one with uh, how. Um, how? How will? Will? Uh -huh. uh, sorry, you were cutting off. How will? 
we can repair this. How will we repair? We don't need can repair. right now. Repair this. Okay. And remember that in okay. this one, this can be anything. When will we repair this? Great. Give me three more. Uh, we are working with WH. WH words. Uh, but it's okay, right? <laughs> um, as a matter of fact, how it is considered a WH um, Oh, really? <laughs> question. Yes, a WH okay. word. It does not begin with WH, but it has WH. Uh-huh. Okay. All right. Give me one more. Well, no. Who will be in the conference? Who will be in the... Ooh, that's a tricky one. Uh -huh, I like it. Like it. One, two, three, four. Two more. When will you go to school? Nice. When will... Let's go ahead and change it. When will children return to school? So we can change a little bit the vocabulary. One more. Using which what time? will Michelle? Okay, which will Michelle choose? Okay, in that case, it's going to be which one, and that one which can be one? anything. Okay. Will which one Michelle choose? choose. Okay, so I'm going to. You know the drill. That's another expression. Do you know what is the meaning of you know the drill? Uh, <coughs> ladro. Hmm. That's a tricky one. Drill? Uh huh. Drill. Mm -hmm. D R I L L. Correct. That's a ladro? Yes. So guys, this is the beautiful thing of English. Drill, if we have it as a noun, it is um, taladro. If we have it as a verb, it is taladrar. If we have it as, a, as in this expression, a drill is, a, another meaning is simulacro. As a noun, simulacro. So you can have an earthquake drill, a fire drill. And if you say, you know the drill, it's an idiom like, you know what to do. Ya sabes que hacer, you know the drill. You know the drill. So guys, you know the drill. I already sent this to the WhatsApp group. Let's go ahead and accept the invite and you got another five minutes. There we go. Please accept the invite. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Adriana, uh, Adriana, uh, why, why would I, uh, why, why I would, why would I would move? Mm -hmm. I would move so far. But. In, in one example with Maritza, he said first would and then the verb. Let me yes. check. So I he would. He asked, he asked what, what? With Maritza. And that one, when, when he asked what will Maritza do tomorrow, he asked 
he asked what Marisa would do. Correct. To so you're going to have In something. this case, if it was the same, Adriana asked why I would move so far. Mm -hmm. Or yes. why move. Uh, no, the thing I is that, move. keep this in mind, why Maria move? Isabel, that if you have, mm -hmm. would I, if you keep the same order, is it is still a question. And you have, what you have to do is eliminate the possibility of a question here. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Si usted le deja el would I, siempre es una pregunta. Okay. Entonces hay que dar de vuelta para eliminar ese problema de la pregunta. Uh -huh. So would be Adriana ask why I would move so far. Correct. Okay. Next one is when will Will Smith visit El Salvador? El Salvador. Okay. What about Will Smith? Okay. So. Is Isabel as continue, girls? Let me check another room. You're doing good. Okay. Okay. Hey guys. Marcela. Marcela. Who? Who would be? Who would no. Be? No. Who you? Who that? Who, who I? Be? You? I think that's not. Um, it doesn't have like a subject. I think no. Mm -hmm. Because the who is. Um, um, I guess Ernesto. No, Marcel asked who. Who would be? No. Uh, I think we don't need the subject because we are using who. Okay. Uh -huh. The question is to know the subject, right? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So, teacher, oh. can you help us? <laughs> you have no verb because you are using who. You don't know who. That's why you're asking who. <laughs> so it, it can be asked who would be in, in the conference. There you go. Yeah, because you don't have it, you don't use it. Okay, thank you. Sir. When will children return to school? Oh, it's just so sad. April. When children. The children, oh, okay. Huh? No, no, it's all the children. <laughs> No, children or okay. the children? I, I don't know. Okay, it's okay, uh, children. Yeah. Children would return to school. All right, you have one minute. See you in the main room. Thank you. Okay. The next.
Okay, guys. So people is starting to come back. We are missing just like two groups. All right. All righty. So thank you very much. Remember, you are all muted. I mean, just in case you want to participate, right? Now, I need a volunteer. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Me. Me, Roxana. That's the attitude. Go with the first one, please. Okay, the first one. And let me. Oh, I don't know what he said. Sara asked why I will move so far. Is that correct, guys? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. it is. I agree. Okay. Nice. Now, in this one, the pronunciation as. Ask. So we're going to have three sounds. Ask. Like kekos in our houses, as, Ask. as, like tomato, as, as, <laughs> so, everybody with me, pronunciation guys, you have to take it slow at the beginning and little by little, like a train, you start gaining speed. So you go with as, okay, so you got to make sure that you can pronounce them. Everybody, us. 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 Yes. Us. Where is the sound coming from? From here. Here. Like camello, coyote, culebra. Right? Us. Same as in Spanish, just the same sound. Um, us. And then the like tomate, tomato. Ask. Everybody. Ask. 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 Okay, good. So, <laughs> bye guys. La primera es fácil. As, right? Con una S. Ask. Luego la K, como de kilo. Ask. Ask. Viene de aquí atrásito. Ask. 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 And then Ask. the T. Ask. No para todos es Ask. fácil, guys. Ask. Viene como tamal. Toyota. Ask. Tornillo. Ask. 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 Ahí vamos. Very good. So then we go like this. Do not repeat. Please do not repeat. As. As. You make sure that you can produce the three sounds. And then you start speeding it up. Ask, 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 ask. You gotta say, you gotta be able to say it at least three or five times. Ask, 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 ask. If you can do this, you will never forget. I promise. So everybody try to say it five times in a row. Ask, 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 
Me, Daniel. Go ahead, sir. Okay. He asked who will be in the conference. Exactly. He asked who would be in the conference. Do you notice anything weird on that one? Yeah, in this case, we don't use the pronouns after the, the WH question. Correct. Why? Because, um, Where's the sub? because, he, because in this uh, question, we are done uh, make a reference to a specific person. Exactly, because we are using who. And what is the point yeah. of using who? Finding out who the subject is. Great job. And I think we have the last one, right? No, we have two no, more. We two, have more. Two, mm -hmm. more. two more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Me? Go ahead, Ana Maria. Uh, they ask when the children will return to school. Yes. Good. I want to hear that asked, please. She asked the when tea. the children... Just ask. The T has asked. is the final sound. Asked. A little bit harder. Asked. Okay. She asked. Again. She asked. Que suena la T como que la está dejando ir. Asked. She asked. Ahí está. There you go. Guys, you can all do it. Unless you have any physical problem with your mouth or muscles, right? Otherwise, you can do it. Good job, Ana Maria. And the last one. Thank you, Abner, for raising your hand. Go ahead. Marcela asked, which one Michelle will choose? Is that correct, guys? Yes. yes. Yes, great job. Okay, so how do you feel with these three? Yeah. Yeah? Are you getting the hang of it? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I think oh, it's okay. Wow. okay, great. So listen, yes. uh, grammar can be tedious, tedioso. But I like once, it. Once no, you I like grammar. It, you I feel, like grammar. You feel so like realized, oh my God, I am finally understanding this. Yes. Right? That okay. feeling yeah. is better than being at the beach with your family with a lot of food and drinks. Um, <laughs> mm, um, well, I I'm no, exaggerating a little bit, but, uh -huh, but but it's good. <laughs> okay, so good, guys. I need six brave people right now. I need the first one. Okay? Remember, guys, when I am sharing the screen, I cannot see all of you. I just see, like, eight people. Normally, I am moving them, but I don't see all of you. So I know that Ana Maria wants to participate. When I am sharing, say, me and the name. It's easier for me. Go ahead with number one. Me, Sara. Uh, I got Ana Maria, Sara number two. Mm -hmm. Me, Marcela. Marcela number three. Okay, let's keep it here because I won't remember. Ana Maria, Sara, Marcela. Go, Ana Maria, with number one. Gosh. <laughs> no wait fear. Up, up. <laughs> um... Oh, it's with ease. Uh -huh. Let me see. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Please, uh -huh. please. Come on, please. come on. Check your notes. I need okay. a volunteer for number four, guys. Is there a I'm giving you, Ana Maria, I'm giving you time, okay? Think. Volunteer for number four, guys, please. Come on, don't be afraid. Simple past. If, we, if you make a mistake, I'm going to help you out, or the group will help you out. Number four. Yeah, Adriana. Adriana Beatriz, number five. Charles in her account. Yeah, I get it. Uh, number five, come on, volunteer. Mm -hmm. Jump into the pool, guys. Don't wait for you to fix it. Just participate. Mm -hmm. Me, number five. Celia, and number six. Me, Karen. Go ahead. All right. I can't remember who's number one, two, three, and four. So please, you know, go ahead, Ana Maria, number one. Okay, the customer, why <laughs> is there 2,000 char charge in his account? I don't know. Say it again. The customer, the customer, 
the phrase? A customer asked. Uh huh. W H. Why? Uh huh. There are two thousand. And the verb. There were. What? There was. There was. There was two thousand. Uh huh. Charge. And his account. Nice. Is that correct, guys? Yes. Uh -huh. yeah. Yes, it is. Come on, don't be afraid. The worst that it can happen is, is that you make a mistake. And if you do, we fix it. Great. Congratulations. Yeah. Now, why was is not at the end? Because we use was in the begin before 2000. Mm. If you because notice, the there, and there, there is, and there was, is like a. Exactly. I don't know how to explain that. By the there was has to be with there. <laughs> it goes together, correct? Because uh -huh. if we if we say a customer asked why a two thousand dollar charge in his account was, it makes no sense. So it is correct. Great job, Ana Maria. Thank you for taking the risk. I think this one was. Um, who was this one? Number two. Mm -hmm. Come on, Sarita. Number two is yours, what right? I, yes. Okay. Like I'm it. going to do what I have to, no, what I have to do. What do I have to do? Oh, sorry. A friend asked, Sorry, ask. Don't be sorry. What? Yes, I forget. I'm I'm so sorry every day. <laughs> in see, Spanish. I see. Uh, okay, go go. A friend asked. What? I have. What mm. he had? What he had to do to protect himself pro from identity. Identify, sorry. Identity, ah, stop saying sorry, ident girl. Identity. 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 Okay, I'm going to identity. Thief. Theft. Theft, okay. Nice. Is that correct, guys? Identity. Theft. Now that you have it mixed, it's a little bit more complicated. Relax. Try to remember or compare with your notes. There's nothing wrong with comparing. So, is it okay? Yes. No. I have. No problem. It is good. Yes, it is. I just wanted to wake you up. <laughs> good. What I have. I'm shaking. Yeah, <laughs> and I, I know. Go. What I What he what? had to do. Yes, it is correct. Number three. Um, a customer asked when he would receive fraud alerts. Is that correct? Yes. Sure. Yep, it is correct. Great job. Number four. Mm, but I, I have a little confused. <laughs> I'm a little confused. Yes. Confused. Don't say because yes. Come on, repeat. I'm a little confused. I'm a little confused. Uh huh. Okay, I try. Um, the bank, the bank representative asked asked mm -hmm. when I had. That's my problem. I don't know what's the verb. <laughs> Change. Change. So mm -hmm. when I had change, change. I'm going to help you. When I had, yeah. you keep it as it is. Last. Last change. Changed. Oh, okay. That's my confused. Mm -hmm. My confusion. Confusion. Okay. Change my password. Got it. Is that correct, guys? Yes, yes, it is. Great job, Beatriz. 
Number five, mambo. <laughs> um, long. The customer, <laughs> the customer support agent asked what information they had changed in my bank account. I'm what not sure the last part. Mm -hmm. What information they uh -huh. had changed? Changed or changed? Changed. Uh -huh. In my bank account? What information did they change in your bank account? Uh huh, yeah. I'm not sure on the last part. I'm, I'm not sure if it's your or mine. I what do you say, guys? Mine. Uh -huh. Is that correct? Yeah, Maya. Yeah. I think it's correct. It is correct, yes. The customer service agent asked what information they had changed in my bank account. Yes, correct. Last but not least, number six, please. Uh, a customer asked when when the bank will back get in touch with with him. Uh, you're almost there. What is which one is the verb? Uh, get get in touch. Mm -hmm. Get in touch. Uh huh. With him. With him or with her, right? Because we don't know if it's a man or a woman. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is that correct, guys? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yay. Come on, say it with confidence. Yes, it is, guys. Yay. It is correct. It is definitely correct. So now. It's a, it's, it's a little difficult. <laughs> when you have them all mixed, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How we can do, how we can, how don't can forget we? it. How can we don't forget it when we are talking? Because we don't practice too much English here. Here where? In the class? Here in El Salvador. Oh, you, you are scaring the crap out of me. Okay, now let me ask you something, guys. And this might be a very, a very ridiculous example, but I'm going to say it anyways. <laughs> you know. Um, This is not a war Barça Real Madrid, okay? So any soccer player, for example, choose Cristiano or Messi. Zidane mejor. Zidane. Okay. Do you think Zidane said one day, I already know how to play soccer, I'm going to relax? No. <laughs> Do professionals at any sport practice almost every day? Yes. 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 So that's, you. that's your answer. My job here, guys, and, and I'm saying this in, you know, in a good way, right? Um, my goal is to help you understand how you develop the English is solely up to your effort. Your knowledge is equal to your effort, right? But obviously, once you understand, because if you practice something that is incorrect a million times, then it's going to be, <laughs> you're going to be strong. Sorry, I don't have any muscles. That was just, you know, the idea. Okay, so that's your, that's your thing. Go ahead and practice, practice, practice. One of an, an ex-boss I had told me once, practice makes perfect. And he's right. I'm not looking for perfection but I, I need you to try it. So guys, uh, before we go to the last activity of the day, I'm gonna call the last attendance of 9.45 of the people that are missing. Javier Rodrigo Ayala, Cordoba. Okay. Amy Melissa Rosa, uh, Rosa Palacios. No. Juan Carlos Garcia Laines. Ya se explicó su accidente automovilístico. Alison Isabella Ayala Alfaro. Okay, so guys, this is what I want you to do. 
I'm going to give you five minutes. Um, here, I'm going to give you five minutes. And in these five minutes, I want to create a very, how many groups do I have? Give me a second. I got six room, six uh, groups. I need you to create a one minute role play, but very, very, very uh, intense using this reported speech. What is the scenario gonna be? You're gonna be a customer service representative, a sales agent of any product or service, and a customer is gonna be asking you questions. So for example, if you are a group of three, or even of two, right? You can say, um, hi, this is um, English Corporativo. My name is Alejandro, what can I do for you? Hey man, I am very upset because I ordered something that I never received and you haven't given me my money back. Oh, I'm truly sorry for the inconvenient. Uh, let me go ahead and ask my supervisor and use the structure, okay? Let me place you on hold. Hey, boss, a customer asked, and here is where you get it. Okay? Any questions? You got five minutes to create a one-minute role play. Everybody's going to participate. Use your imagination. And, by the way, each and every one of you has to use the structure. You choose past, present, will, whatever. You gotta do it at least once, each person, in one minute. Okay? Vieja, el de servicio de cliente dice que no me van a dar el reembolso. I don't know. Use your imagination. Go, accept the invite. Five minutes, we come back. Come on, don't cry. It's gonna be okay. Relax. Work on. I have an idea, but I'm in Spanish. Okay, okay, so yeah, that that will work. That will that will will work. Mm, okay, maybe. Yeah, no. you work with a customer service, right? Yes. Ah, okay. So this will be easy. <laughs> it's okay. And let me think something. Okay. Um, uh, something like that in Spanish. Um, for the quarantine and maybe um, um, the office can be paid the some services, uh, some basic services like. Um, Electric energy, okay. And the company, uh, the electric company, come to the office, and, and then they got they got it. Cut, uh, no, they want to cut. Yeah. The okay. the 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 services, but they didn't because the uh, because the. Uh, uh, accountant department uh, actually paid the last week. Okay. Um, okay. But I don't know how we can. Okay, so uh, let's see. Okay, I can be the one that works that work with the electricity company, and you can be the one that receive me in the in the office okay so let me see um there you go other person oh the customer said that she wants a coffee latte and her mom wants a chai tea and her daughter wants uh, and so her her daughter said said her that told her that once oh, sorry 
Sorry? Told her. Told her. Told her. Now remember told her. informational told her. questions. Okay, told her. Told her that she wants a frappuccino too. Okay, let's prepare. And I'm going to do that mix, the mix. And I'm going to save my bus. Okay. Uh, tell my I, bus. Tell my bus. Uh -huh. Sorry, we got to work in the difference between tell and say, okay? Because of time, I'm not going to explain it to you right now. But write it down. Say versus tell. Mm -hmm. Tell my Continue. bus. Uh, Informational oh, questions. Yeah. Continue. Yes, yes. Four uh, minutes. Question. Guarantee that we that we sell uh, does not cover the air conditioner, so there's nothing we can do for him. I'm sorry. Those words. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's in the contract that that he signed. So. All right, I, I will shame. have to tell him. All right. <laughs> yeah. I have a question. <laughs> Are you using your your recorded speech informational question each? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can say like um, the providers of the cars said that no. Remember that these are our questions. You can use Question. asked, mm -hmm. inquired. Come on, you got two minutes. Goodbye. Uh, tick so, tack, tick tack, tick tack, tick tack. Um, we can like. Mm -hmm. Hi girls, how are you doing? Hi. Love. So yes, yeah, it's how much? <laughs> how thing, much? It? Uh, we are playing that I called the bank because I don't get my balance account. Thing. Uh -huh. thing ago and I want to know why. Oh. So Aliana said, tell her, <laughs> tell her Aliana. Tell her, hey, come on, okay. tell, him. tell him. <laughs> tell him. <laughs> him. Okay, yes. Now, before so, you start, Bea, perdón, I'm sorry to stop you. Maria Isabel, check the difference between since and ago. I cannot explain to you right now because mm -hmm. of time. But for example, next Wednesday, if it's your turn, I can explain to you since versus ago. Keep it in mind. Mm -hmm. Ah, tell me. Okay, so um, the the conversation or I, I I don't know. I thought you had a question. What did you ask oh. to your supervisor? What did you say to your supervisor? So uh, I want to ask her how much the Payment was okay. Okay, so but the complaint was that I am I I am paying fifty dollars since December, uh -huh. and Good. I don't have my balance anytime. Why? Okay. So the question is why didn't I right get my balance? Mm -hmm. The customer asked why didn't I have my balance or oh, the get consumer my balance? Asked. I write why and she past had to past not perfect. Had, yes. Why she had not had her balance uh, balance account for the last six months. Mm -hmm. Okay, sounds good to me. Okay. So, but I want to ask um, how much, uh, how much payment or how much uh, money was in your bill monthly? Oh, but, but remember that in that case, you are not, uh, that is uh, a direct question. But, but that is what I don't know because I don't have any balance. Uh -huh. How much was your bill? That's a, that, because you're asking her, mm -hmm. right? Uh -huh. Now, if you had to ask your supervisor, remember it's reported speech. You are reporting oh. what someone else is saying. Okay. Hey, uh, supervisor, the customer asked, the customer inquired, and there you go. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. Stop. Okay, so it's like my supervisor asked. I am asking to my supervisor at this moment, and in a few minutes, in a few minutes, I give you a, an answer. I will give you an answer. Okay, uh, supervisor Daniel, Daniel, are you there? Thank yes. you, Ana Maria. Okay, yes, Daniel. Here. Daniel, I have a customer. Her name is Karen, and she asked why she didn't receive her medicine at this moment. Okay. Why she hadn't? Why she hadn't received her medicine at this moment? Um, you got it. Okay. Uh, what, what, uh, what, what would is, I answer her? Okay. Uh, the medicine don't, 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 no llegó uh, in nice. this moment because, because I have a problem with the motorcycle uh, of the, la emplea, delivery, la mo man? The, delivery, okay, delivery men. And I, I think in 30 minutes, uh, he, he... It's a one minute role play. It's Don't a one extend it that much. Ah, okay, okay. Don't extend it that much. You got, I already gave you three more minutes, so let's go back. Uh, teacher, teacher, I have a uh -huh. question. Go ahead. Uh, mensajero is, a, uh, you said delivery man, it's okay? I would say the messenger. Ah, the messenger. Mm -hmm. Normally, I'm, I'm okay. a messenger. Remember the application, the famous application back in the days? Like from chatting in the computer, on the computer? Messenger. Uh -huh. Messenger, okay, thank you. You're welcome. Continue, Daniel. Okay. All right, so you're starting to come back. I have a question, guys, and I think I already know the answer. Do you find this difficult? Yes. To put it in practice? Mm hmm All right. So who wants to be the pioneer? We need more time. Yes. We need, we need, we need we more time. We need a few minutes more. Mm-hmm. A few more minutes. Tomorrow, right. tomorrow, tomorrow. Okay, go ahead, Ernesto. Thank you. Thank you for letting me know. Okay, um, I need a volunteer. Me, Eric. Okay. Eric and friends. Rocket, one minute. Okay, but we didn't finish the dialogue. Don't <laughs> just worry. Gonna, just we're going to say that we have. Show me what you got. It's got to be a one-minute audio. Uh, one-minute audio. Okay. Sorry, that's another kind of homework. Uh, one-minute role play. Okay, here we go, group. Good evening. Excuse me, ma'am. Do you know when my shoes will arrive? Team. Where's my team? Hello. Hello. Uh, <laughs> Who's your team? I'm here, but... But Celia we're like waiting for Celia. Celia. Celia is not here. Oh, she, no, she is here. Celia, but she, Celia you're I'm here. here. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Okay, uh, I'm starting again. Uh, good evening. Excuse me, ma'am. Do you know yes, when sir. my shoes will arrive? Uh, let me verify with my supervisor. Um, Gladys, a customer asked when his shoes will arrive. Uh, let me check. <laughs> Big chain, mm -hmm. uh huh? Uh, do you know when did he do the purchase? Uh, let me ask him. Uh, sir, excuse me, when did Mm, mm, report it. I'm not sure how to continue. When uh, my supervisor asked when you have done the purchase? Uh, well, why did you ask me that? <laughs> why do you ask me that? <laughs> yeah, why, why do you ask me that? So, 
that was the last part that we did. Yeah. Okay, so now Eric, <laughs> we, we, normally uh, your partner will be able to tell you. I would ask my wife, hey girl, when? So ask your partner. Oh. Let me ask my wife. Uh -huh, okay, go. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, darling, she, uh, she asked me when, mm. when, uh, let's see, when I had that, uh, when I had done the purchase? Yesterday, honey. Oh, thank you, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> okay so great that's exactly what it is so guys listen um that's exactly again i mean i i can't tell you how how happy i am because i see you all smiling on like yesterday that you were oh my god i can't do this so don't worry <laughs> we will continue practicing this but you have proven yourself that um of course if the explanation is easy <laughs> and we <laughs> practice you can achieve great things. So for the ones who want, that means all of you guys, please try to prepare it. The same thing, that was one minute. Try to prepare it with your classmates uh, for tomorrow, for the first minutes of the class, right? Remember, it's gotta be quick. You guys have done an amazing job, okay? Question, I don't know, let me ask. She said, oh, she said, Right, so you're going back and forth with the questions, okay? okay. Um, a couple of reminders, I'm gonna let you go in a minute. I already explained to you why, right? So um, I have been checking the forum, right? Not everybody is checking the forum, it is uh, commenting the posts. The thing is that right after the class, I post a question and I check this post tomorrow before or after the class, okay? For the ones that have participated, you can see that I try to correct if there's any mistake. So if you do not participate, you have to do it. <laughs> I mean, it's a requirement. But if you, don't have, if you don't do it in the time that I'm asking you to, which is within the next 24 hours, I do not have the chance to reply, okay? Now, so remember to practice that. Thank you for most of you having the camera on. Thank you for having your, your full name. Make sure you continue doing the working on the platform. I know there are uh, some things that do not work properly. And that's why I'm gonna stay right after this class. If you have a question, text me right now. Because I'm gonna be helping you. Do it in the group. If you have an answer that someone else is asking, share. Right? Share why, explain, don't just cheat. <laughs> That's plain and simple. Okay, thank you very much, guys. Any question you might have? No, no, it's okay. Thank you for all your effort. This is Alejandro Narbona on behalf of Inglés Corporativo. With all my love and respect, get out of here, go to rest. Good night. Good night. Bye -bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. 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 Thank <laughs> you.